Hello everybody and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. So I found Joe Cobb on my way out of town, so let's take over this ghost town. It's about time. Right, there we go. <laughs> We've taken over the town. That was easy. So basically, because everyone was dead, we didn't actually have to kill anything. And now, we get powder gangers to kill. Right, so everyone's settled in, in the little bar here. So let's murder us some powder gangers. They're all congregating in one group, so this might be a bit of a problem. There's always one that leaves the rest of the pack. And he decides to get up. Sit. Down. Morning. Morning. John died. Sorry. <laughs> so, our good friend Mr. Cobb decided to make the same mistake as John did. Okay, so we've got to make sure he dies in one hit. Okay. Oh, hey guys, uh, Joe died. As well as John. Do you want to go check that out? Yeah? Okay. I love that they're all sitting in the same chair, although there's bodies just sitting around them. And... Death. So, funny story, the Powder Gangers are not the most intelligent bunch. They keep splitting out. Uh, guys, we seem to have a problem people keep dying. It wasn't me. So it's either one of you two. Yep, you, you're gonna go check on the dead bodies? No? Okay, don't do that. And... Dead! Okay, so we've... <laughs> well, we've managed to kill the entire bar without anyone noticing. So, let's clean up this town. So, unfortunately, on our way to Prim, we found these two guys, so they have to die. Now, they're kind of covering each other quite well, so we're kind of going to have to get a quick shot in when one isn't looking. It would help if they stopped moving. That's one. That's lucky. That's two. Good thing I stole the silence pistol. I could have been harder. So, unfortunately, again, on our way to Prim, we found another two powder gangers, and unfortunately, they die now. So, we're going to take them out in style with throwing weapons. Because I, I thought spearing someone might be fun. Cut it out, will you? It wasn't me. Uh -huh. <laughs> I said it wasn't me. Well, that went bad. You'll be going back home in a body bag, you bastard. So basically, I arrived at Prim, and I was dressed as a powder ganger. So this guy here took it upon himself to attack me. Bad choice. And... Dead! Alright, let's get on and clear out the NCR, shall we? Because, as normal, no one survives. Okay, so this guy decided to disturb us while we were waiting for morning. He must die, and also he's going to betray us later if we don't kill him anyway. Okay, so this silence pistol is going to become really handy. Especially when people try to leave. Oh, Prem, what a lovely place to kill. Let's get on with it, shall we? Ah, our first victim in Prem, right. Now, seeing as I don't think these guys can be not aggroed, let's just go in all guns blazing, shall we? Hey look, you! You have no face! You had more of a face than I thought. <laughs> no, put that gun down. Thank you! That ended a bit more violently than it should have. 
Hello, residents of Prim. And I come in peace for the matter of three seconds until I empty your cash supplies and kill you all. Okay, so we are at Prim, and now I have sold off everything that we had. And I was thinking... Well, Prim is a sort of rocking upcoming town, so I'm going to rock it in its sort of own way. We're going to be taking this town out loud. So let's get on to murder. Okay, so, we've got to scout the place out. Or, shoot people in the back. <laughs> now this is, a, this is an interesting way of taking things. Okay, so... This is a bad idea. <laughs> okay, so a shotgun isn't apparently a good idea to murder an entire city with. How about a grenade launcher? Hmm, that seems to do the job. Right, let's stim back up again. Okay, so apparently, okay, so from now on I'm not going to attack a city very loud like this. Johnson Nash has died, oh no! Prem Slim isn't even attacking. <laughs> we need something powerful and fast. Aha, the thing that. This killed that easy peep. Crimson started. Okay, so that went bad fast. So we may not do that again. We're probably probably gonna use stealth from now on. That was a mistake. Well, let's collect our spoils, shall we, from the entire town? Right, so we've killed the town and dropped all of their belongings behind and leveled up. Okay, so we wave goodbye to Prim. And we head on to greener pastures such as the NCR outpost and the hotel over the road. Now here we go, the lucky casino. Now the reason I'm attacking this place is because they're holding hostage someone that I want to kill, so, you know. I free them, then kill them. It works out. So it seems that immediately we've been found. So maybe the stealth action won't work in this place either. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> Okay, so it's kind of dangerous outside. Okay. <laughs> Pretty damn dangerous outside. Hello? You guys you, you guys stopped attacking me yet? Okay, so that's kind of dangerous outside. Alright, we need a better weapon. Because this gun's just not doing it anymore. How about this one? Alright, what can I do? is heal and then get really close and bang. Okay, so this is a pretty good gun, um, it's just that we need to get really close to their face. Okay, so we've changed up our strategy, we're going ninja. Let's do this. Let's not do this. Let's get a better gun. Hmm, so better guns work. They work quite well. So I just remembered we have a machine gun. This machine gun isn't doing that good. Oh my god. Mr. Leader Guy, you're, pow you're powerful. I've got to say. So, we need to kill this guy. Okay, let's get out some vats, see how that does. Vats does amazingly well. And same to that guy. Okay, so maybe sometimes we're going to have to rely on vats, especially if something like this happens. <laughs> okay, so we've saved Deputy Beagle, that's a good thing. And we're starting to heal up. So, Miss Beagle, our reward for saving you, unfortunately for you, and very, very lovely for me, is your death. <laughs> so I think that's actually everyone in Prim. Get Beagle's journal from his corpse to get information on your attackers. Yep, that sounds about right. Okay, so officially the end of Prim. We are taking out the NCR guarding it. And taking him out like a ninja. That didn't work. 
Okay, so... Okay, so throwing kunais. Not as useful as I expected. But no one will know he's dead. Hopefully. Okay, so turns out um, the NCR knew he was dead. Who would have known? So it looks like things are going to get a bit bloody again. This whole stealth thing seems to have stopped working, actually. Hello, you. Oh, crap. It's Sergeant McGee. Stop moving. Come back at. Come. Yep. Why am I crouching still? Come back at. Come. Oh, for God's sake. I hate it when they run. It just, just makes murdering so much more awkward. What are you doing? <laughs> McGee. There we go, right. So it seems I'm going to have to murder them all. Sergeant McGee died, apparently. Um, so it seems like I'm going to have to murder them all, like, without the stealth option. That's just irritating. Okay, right, so I had an idea. We're going to take him up with dynamite, because that will work. Because there's multiple guys in there. Right, light, throw! Okay, so dynamite isn't, doesn't seem to work that well. Keep dynamiting them! <laughs> I'm shunned by the NCR. Shun. 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 What sort of a status is shun? You are shunned by the NCR. Please stop murdering our people and we will unshun you. But anyway, I think that's it for today. We've murdered quite a lot of people. That's the entire town of Prim gone. I may go up to the the correctional facility and murder all those guys because they got problems with me and anyone that has problems with me has declared war and killed themselves. I'm not sure though. But anyway, thank you for joining me. This has been the Kill Everything Run of New Vegas. Until next time, shell out your faces and stay away from murderers.